We have major breaking news to talk about this midday. Three children who are hurt have been located after an Amber Alert out of Virginia Beach this morning. It ended with a crash in Prince George's County, Maryland. That's just outside of DC. This is brand new video of police on the interstate after we're told the suspect pictured here, Dana Plummer, who is their father, was caught four hours away with those three abducted children in his car. Right now, we're working with our affiliate stations to piece together what happened. This all started with a stabbing and abduction on JR Court off Wesleyan Drive. We first told you about this as breaking news on Wavy News 10 today. We have team coverage of this investigation. So many different moving parts. 10 on your sides, Ashley Knight is live outside the home where this all started. Ashley. Asia, this is such a heartbreaking story. Let's get right to it. The Maryland State Police spokesperson has confirmed to our Fox affiliate in D.C. that this Amber Alert ended this morning just before 9 o'clock after that rollover crash this morning. They say it happened in Prince George's County. Two children are in serious condition, one child in critical condition. That one child airlifted to a local hospital. Let's start back. The last night, this is when it all started, just before 9 o'clock last night in Virginia. Virginia Beach police responded to the 900 block of JR Court in response to that stabbing. They say a woman and a child were found stabbed at this house. Virginia Beach police tell us the woman's estranged husband, Dana Plummer, is the suspect. They say Plummer also abducted three children, seven-year-old Zion Plummer, five-year-old Zaire Plummer, and 16-month-old Zariah Plummer. They left in a black 2024 Honda Passport SUV. Our Fox affiliate in DC says there was a police pursuit that began in Springfield, Virginia, and it was on I-95 just before 9 a.m. this morning. That ended in a rollover crash on I-495 and Branch Avenue. Again, one child in critical condition, two in serious condition. We know Dana Plummer and his estranged wife divorced in 2022. Both were veterans of the Navy at that time. We also know there was something called an emergency substantial risk order placed on Dana Plummer in April of this year. That required him to surrender all all of his firearms. This is very much a developing story. We will have much more information on this story coming up tonight on Wavy News 10. For now, live in Virginia Beach, Ashley Knight, 10 on your side.